Hello and welcome. We've just gone six o'clock on what is Monday, the 2nd of January. As you can see, this is the latest promo. Winter Wildcard still cracking on through with this. A couple of really good cards, a couple of frankly next to nothing behind the curve kind of cards. But today we're just going to have a look and see what's new, what's here, and just generally if anything is actually worth getting involved in. Um, so let's go objectives first, see if anything new is there. We will obviously, oh yeah, today is R Ronaldo 96 icon card day, isn't it? Yeah, cool, 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 cool. That's good, although obviously everybody's going to have it, so it will be slightly less good. But it still, still counts, still counts. We have no events, no milestones, no, no objectives. So, go and have a look at moments first before going into SPCs and whatnot here. And it doesn't look like we have anything here. My mouse is... Ah, oh, there we go. Right. So, yeah, nothing going on there. Hmm. Uh, back to SPCs. What do we have today? We have... Rodrigo de Paul is still going on. Three days left on him. Four days left on Mesut Ozil. Ten days left on Eric Bailly. And ten days left on Silas Mvampa. <laughs> we have a John Joe Kenny. Well, if he is three-star, two-star, that's not great. He can play left-back. To be honest, I'd forgotten he'd moved to... Um, the Bundesliga. I thought he was still at Everton for some reason. You said that name and I immediately thought of um, Everton. Now, for an 87 rated card, obviously, very good pace. Um, the physicals are pretty good. The 83 is a little bit deceptive given his aggression, jumping, stamina are all at least five higher. The defending 84 is okay. Defensive awareness isn't the best and obviously his heading isn't going to be that good considering he was was 5'8", 5'9", 5'9". High attacking, low defending work rates is a little interesting. But he can play left to back as well. And obviously the one thing he's known for, tremendous shot power for a fullback. And that's just what you want. And no real traits. I don't know, it's a bit of a weird card. Um, it's like, is, is it the third English Bundesliga player they've given cards to? What, it's two segments? Sorry, I went, it's going to be 83 and 84, surely. 84 with a team of the week as well. Prime Electrons and Gold Pack. Um, English Bundesliga. Okay, it's the fourth Bundesliga English player they've given a special card to. And none of them... Are, oh, fifth, because Bellingham has got had some as well. So hudson Adoy had the objective. Oxford also had uh, the Winter Wild card, which is this one. And then Osu Tutu, Osai Tutu, has also had this card as well. Which is good for a number of positions, actually. That is, that's decent. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a it's a it's a trait having English players in the Bundesliga giving them special cards. I guess they've done that for to know whether it's a reason or whether they've just picked a name that English football fans will be particularly familiar with. I mean, he didn't turn up any trees, particularly Everton, and then went out there. So what else do we have? Daily login upgrade. Winter wild card with the two rares. So let's do this. This is the one bronze. Um, where is a bronze common? There we go. He has gone. One more objective bit achieved. And who's winter wild card today? Ooh, we'll go Lacazette, please. 
He's an unusual considering all the lowest rated ones I've had recently. Oh, and three rare players rated 78 or higher. Repeatable for three days. That's a random pack. Draft token is back. Position modifier is still there. Winter wild card is a token and a small rare gold. Hopefully this won't be too much then. Four golds and then the rest can be bronzes. Um, we can put some higher rated ones in this because then I can make all the rest of them bronzes which makes it easier. Twenty five cam. Hmm. To put him in. Could really sort bomb to top here. Twenty four cam, so we just basically need another Brazilian or something. I'll do. No, not right wing, left wing. There we go. Left wing. Cool. It's a bit above what we needed, but we'll get it. We get the token, we get the small rare, and we don't lose anybody particularly important that we're not going to get back within the next couple of packs anyway. Those are pretty common players. He moves over, Calico. And so, this 78 plus triple upgrade, that could give some good... I wonder what they priced as. it all rare or all gold? Oh, okay. One red, nine... Okay. That's, I thought it was going to be higher than that, but we'll give it a go. We'll do some. Um, leave the French. Um, Saudi, English, English and English. So it's basically players you don't want for players with a minimum rating of 78 or higher. Plus you're going to get three, plus any duplicates you do get can go straight back in it anyway. So I guess it kind of, that actually works out okay. Unless I'm missing something obvious. We'll open a couple of them, so just to see what's, like the initial base mark of what is coming out of them. Uh, so there's... The only new player added today is that Kelly card, a Bundesliga fullback. Um, so it's not they're not um, breaking down the walls of what's new within the game with that. It's a fairly standard card. You could go with any kind of chem you wanted on it, depending on whether you're playing him uh, left back, right back, etc., uh, or wing back. Obviously, because wing backs need slightly different requirements. Right, Ronaldo joins. He will be useful in, I don't know, friendlies of some sort. And what's the last thing for tomorrow? 10, 10 83 pluses and a winter wildcard player pack. So probably we're going to get Greedo or whoever the lowest rated one is. Um, but that's okay. Right. Um, Brentford have just scored a second against Liverpool. They're now 2 0 up in quite. And there's still first half there, still five minutes left of the first half. That's not too bad. 84 and an 83. Gvardiol goes to the bin. Let's open this 81 plus times 2, and then we're going to test out these two, see what sort of things that they're giving out. Come on, lights. No, not lights up there. 
Rabio, no. Too shabani. And a duplicate tradable? No. Untradable Oscar. Right, so 80, 78 pluses, three rare gold players rated 78 or higher. No lights up. Obviously, these cards could give fairly standard rewards like this. See, 78, 79 from a 78 plus. Um, but obviously, there's no upper limit on it, so you can get special cards out of it. I'd imagine you can get special cards out of it. It does say rare gold returns, but they are the current versions of those rare golds. So, hopefully we get a special one to test that theory, but you never know. This second live, uh, second Brentford goal is now being VIR'd all over the place, so it may be about to be cancelled. Sorry, wiped off, cancelled, whatever you want to call it. Is he... To be fair, 80, 82 and 83 out of that pack isn't that bad. We will try a couple more just to see what we get. But other than that, it seems like an okay thing. Um, do we have any icons? I didn't even check for icons. So we've got... We had the Daily SPC. We had John Joe Kenny. Uh, it's no goal ruled as offside. So it's back to 1-0. Triple upgrade is there. Draft token pack is back. We have new icon. No new icon. Nothing else there. And we also have a short period of time until... Um, where did it say? One day and 23 hours. So it's two days time. So Tuesday, Wednesday evening. And... I think Brentford have just actually scored again. Right, we're going to go out and go back in just to make sure. But I think Brentford have actually just made it 2 0 properly this time. Which is a bizarre deja vu experience. But there you go. I don't think this one's going to be ruled out. It's Visser again. You go live football commentary in my video today. Quite different to normal. So yeah, doesn't look like anything. No. So it's it's Kenny. It's an an upgrade. The, the 87, 78 plus triple, and the daily SPCs and the daily login thing, which is okay, I guess. But it's not. Kenny's not going to be like nobody's going to be jumping at the chance to complete him. Obviously, he links well with the other English guys if you're using them within the game, within gameplay, but. And it's relatively cheap, it's 83 84, but it's nothing special at all. To be honest, you can craft them with the upgrades, which is a viable option for him. Other than that, we'll end the video there. Thank you for watching, appreciate that, and I'll see you this time tomorrow. Bye bye.